All right. So today we continue the study on um, my place, sorry, um, on the tools for victory and success. And I want to just make sure you have it on the screen, but let's read the scripture in the book of Hebrews in chapter 11, um, verse 1, Hebrews chapter 11, verse 1. Because today we are looking, we have seen, um, we have seen um, um, the first tool, visualization. We've seen the second tool yesterday. We're looking at focus. And today we're looking at faith. These are tools for victory and success that God wants us to have. Victory and success. And we need to make sure we engage these tools so that we can be able to excel all that we do. And God wants us to walk in this fullness of his glory in our lives in the name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus, for your help and your mercies. So we'll read Hebrews in chapter... Eleven verse one, and the Bible says, "By faith." Now faith. Okay, yeah, I've been able to get that done. Thank you. Okay, so now faith is the substance of things hoped for, the evidence of things not seen. Faith is the substance of what you are hoping for, the evidence of what you cannot see. All right. And faith is very essential to in uh, victory and success, all right? Success is one of the beauties of life. Success is, is the dopamine that all humans look forward to. Whether it is success of completing a desired meal or to accomplishing a target or a goal, success is sweet to the soul. God wants success and victory. They are sweet to the soul. God wants us to succeed. However, he wants us to succeed in things that add to, um, in things that add to and contribute to his eternal plan for us all. This is why it is important to daily, weekly, and regularly succeed in the things we are sure are in line with God's will. This gives the Bible this gives us what the Bible called good success, which is different from ordinary success. Ordinary success is achieving what you design to achieve, whether it's to kill somebody else or to carry out a stealing or something. Good success, however, is the accomplishment of anything that contributes to God's eternal plan. To achieve good success, we have seen that we need some tools. We have covered visualization and focus as part of the tools. Today, we are looking at another tool, which is faith. And it's very simple. All right. You have to apply faith if you want to succeed. And what dimension of faith do you apply? What you believe is God's will, speak it and act upon it. Faith is action. Faith is obedience. Faith is doing God's will. Faith is doing what God said. Faith is acting in line with what God has spoken. Even if it's a promise, you're acting in line with that promise. That's what faith is. Faith is, necess is necessary to, to, pass, to bring to pass the beautiful visions and things that we are focused on in our imagination. If you're focused on something, if you have an expectation, if you have any hope at all, faith is what converts that hope into reality. And that's another tool for us there in the... Uh, tools for success all right don't forget the tool of visualization don't forget the tool of focus and today we learn the tool of faith glory to god pray with me and say father i receive grace to apply these tools for success this year and to walk in the fullness that you have for me in the name of jesus pray that in the holy ghost in Jesus' mighty name, we are prayed. All right, it's time to confess the word. Remember, the words you speak today creates the future you want tomorrow. 
you don't say where where you are at that means you don't say what you're going through unless your doctor your lawyer your pastor the ones that are relevant to each of them you know you only say where you are going to and the bible teaches us to say it like we are already there so say with me say in the name of jesus i am the healed because jesus christ took all diseases sicknesses and infirmity and therefore i can never be sick i live in sound health all my life me and my household in the name of jesus i am the rich because jesus died for the poor i should have been and i have the power to get wealth so wealth flow to my life in the name of jesus i am the favored one yes because god has surrounded me with favor as a shield i excel in all that i do i am the secured one i and my household will dwell in god's sacred place under god's shadow no evil can befall us no plague can come near us in the name of jesus i am the blessed one and blessed going out blessed coming in i manifest the fullness of christ's character thinking what jesus will think saying what jesus will say doing what jesus will do in all situations in the name of jesus i declare i manifest the fullness of christ's power i cast out devils i lay hands on the sick and they all recover in the name of jesus i manifest the fullness of christ wisdom in all areas where i'm engaged i manifest wisdom i do exploits i create solutions i cause advancements in the name of jesus i manifest the fullness of christ's presence everywhere i am the presence of god soaks the place sinners have come to christ the sick have been healed demons have fled the powers of hell have been seized there and the glory of god has covered the earth as what has covered the sea i am one spirit with the lord therefore i enjoy an inward access to the lord to the father i fellowship with him i hear his voice i have conversations with him every day and in the name of jesus i'm a carrier of his presence everywhere i go in the name of jesus i declare i am head and never tail i'm from above so i'm above all in all areas where i'm engaged my home is god's habitation my children are taught of god great is their peace and they are mighty on the earth in jesus mighty name amen <music>